Hey friends, it's Cecily and welcome back to This Week in Rideshare News. A California judge ruled on Monday that both Uber and Lyft must reclassify their drivers as employees due to a state law that went in effect in January. Not so new. Both Uber and Lyft said they're going to stop operations next week if they do not get their way. They said that they would temporarily shut down operation if they weren't able to get their appeal. Well, Thursday came and went and Uber and Lyft lost their appeal. Uber now says that they're going to shut down the ride hailing service on August 21st. So once they return, they say that they'll be able to hire back only a fraction of their workforce under these more rigid schedules and guidelines. So we're waiting to see who's going to be in business next week, right? Now everyone's saying that nothing's stopping Uber and Lyft from providing flexible work while treating drivers as employees. So we're not sure why they have to shut down. But the San Francisco's DA's office has also filed an injunction against DoorDash in an attempt to make them classify their drivers as employees. It's the same type of ruling that Uber and Lyft are dealing with this week. DoorDash hasn't stated whether they're shutting anything down yet or how they're going to respond. I think it's really time for a new rideshare company to slide in there and pretty much change the game. Like people are ready for a change. Now Amazon is laying off 1200 delivery drivers. Uh, over the past few weeks, they have actually ended contracts with small delivery driving companies across the U.S. Sorry to hear it. Walmart is partnering with Instacart for same-day delivery starting here in a few small markets in the U.S. I'm super excited about that. The partnership is currently in a pilot phase in a few markets across California and Oklahoma. I'm actually here for this partnership and I may consider giving Walmart my business after this because my two day delivery has turned into the three to seven day delivery, yet I'm still paying full time for Prime. Okay, so now for this week's What Would You Do? This guy attempts to do a delivery. The next thing that happens leaves him speechless. Do that again? I was delivering my pizza and what were you saying? Get out of here. Why? This is private property and you're trespassing! I'm delivering a pizza. Get out. Jesus Not Christ. What is wrong with you? Will you please get out of my way? <laughs> Are you serious? Get out. I think it's a good learning tool because people like this exist. I know your knee jerk reaction is to curse her out or spit back, but this is very problematic. It's problematic because you don't want to lose your life. So my advice is to recognize crazy from the jump. Crazy starts in the eyes, it's in the grin, it's in the strange octave these people have when they're like shifty and moving around, they're on edge, and trust me, it's not going to get any better. If you can bypass one of these characters and just keep it moving, that's what you should do, no problem. Uh, I know you guys out there probably have experience with these kind of individuals. Let our friends know in the comments what to do. Appreciate you guys watching this video. Great to see you guys every single week. Um, really looking forward to see what happens next week. The saga continues, right? Have a great week, a blessed week. And if you're not subscribed, subscribe. You need to contact me. You can find me at Drive Go Drive. Peace out.